Hey guys, welcome back. So now we got another toy to install. This one's, this one's installed in the trailer. Backup camera. This is an OEM part, as you can see, a hologram, GMC. So 855-87357, quality of one. So, let's see what they give us in the box. Hope it's everything. And hopefully the camera is not too big. So we got instructions for sure. And there seems to be lots of it. Yeah. All right. And don't know. This is the camera? Oh yeah. That's the camera. My God. Okay. And there's plenty of wire with wire loom. So you can run it underneath it. I was planning on running it through, but we'll see, I guess. Hmm. Top, bottom. And yeah. I was hoping for it to be a little smaller because I need to clear. I don't know if you can put it sideways. Like I assume that you can. I'm hoping you can. If I can put it sideways, it's just gonna fit because the line right here that you see, that's where the dirt accumulates. That's where my rubber sits. So hopefully, we'll find out soon enough. So, what else does it come with? Lots of alcohol pads, lots of tie wraps, and lots of places to mount through for the tie wraps to stick everywhere. Like crazy. So that's that for that. And then, two screws, two bolts, okay. So that's good for that. And a lot of zip ties. Okay. So let's see. Hopefully you can place it on an angle. Okay, some people put it right in the middle of the door. Well, I guess you want to have it someplace where you actually you can clean it. I was thinking at the top. Some people put it up. okay right over the top. I see, like right over the top. Roof mounted, rear wall mounted. Uh, it's two options they give you. You can center. Shows you where to plug it. So they're saying either mounted on the roof or mounted in the middle of the door in the back. Well, I don't really want to mount in the middle of the door in the back because my door opens. So the roof mount could be a good idea, but I can take it up the front, run it to the back, and I can use all these sticky pads. on top of my roof and the roof is thin so I shouldn't have a problem mounting it through the roof and there's wood here underneath to basically make it a little tougher than just a thin because this is just a thin sheet of metal right across right but uh, yeah. I don't know. What do you think, Matt? Probably the best idea. Just to mount it right on the roof? Yeah. Get some silicone and seal it really good. Sit it down. I don't know if they, sell, they bring a seal with it.
doesn't look like there's a seal with it. I don't know what this tab is for. Oh, probably just to simply put a tie wrap so this doesn't move. Yeah. Okay. No, I don't think you can move it by hand. It's going to move. Like, I guess you loosen the sides. Well, you loosen the sides and you see little dots there. That's stamped in. You just set it up to the angle you want, right? You just loosen them up. That's what it's going to be. So that's that. So if you're looking at buying a camera and looking at what you're going to get from uh, GM, well, and the options of... Uh, like I, I'm, I suppose that I could probably, like they want this downwards, that I could make a plate and whatever and modify it, that I could shrink it, like I, you could probably grind it off to mount it in the back, drill another hole, like split it off, take the whole camera off. That's probably what I'll do. And you probably could grind a section off that it would clear the door. I could sit, you know, modify, like you can basically do modifications, but, yeah, you got a lip edge, and then it mounts. Let's go see it with the camera, see what it does, what it looks like, and we can take a look at it. So I'm not sure, like I got a lip right here, with a rubber, and then, but anyways, yeah, so, okay. So that's what that is. So I'll have a video of this installation soon. All right, so thanks for watching guys again. This was just a little unboxing. If you're planning on putting a camera on your cargo trailer and you got a GMC or Silverado. So uh, yeah, stay tuned to the next one. Appreciate you guys, keep watching, keep subscribing. Thanks a lot for everything. And I appreciate all the comments. We'll catch you on the next one, bye for now.